Okay, today I would like to share a few ideas what I have done with my running light around the office. Uh, in the past, every time I went to Singapore, there was a shop if you bought for more than um, $250, you got one of these 10 meter LED strings. And uh, I got four of them in blue. Let me show you. And I put these lights all around the office. And what I will going to do, I will put a picture on that uh, little video clip how that looked like. Yeah, at that time it was a good idea, but eh, not really that flash what I had in mind. Okay, so um, now that we can't travel anymore, I decided to spend some money renovating the office and um, first thing we done was the ceiling panels and then we got the place painted, I ripped everything out and now it's the thing, what I don't need doesn't come back in here and I, and I don't want it in here so we're running now on bare minimum. So what I had in, in mind was um, creating a new light around the office. And uh, what I've done, I um, bought these RGB LED strips. They are coming five meter length and it's exactly 40 meters around the office. So I needed eight of them. And um, with a bit of trickery and things like that, I finally got it all done. In the beginning, I wasn't really sure how to do it, but then I had a great idea. So what I've done, I bought these little pieces of timber. It's 18 by 18 millimeter square. And I glued them all around underneath the ceiling because I needed something to get away from the wall because I was um, convinced putting it straight on the wall will create a big problem for me um, putting the feed-in power to the LED strips. And I was very right with that. So what I have done, I glued all these on. In the beginning, I thought I would screw them on and then, nah, it was too much work. So um, I got some, um, what they call liquid nails and um, I've done that. It was quite a bit of work doing that because the walls are not very straight. So uh, I had to clamp them in and oh, it was, yeah, not easy. But we got there finally, it was all done. And then I bought also aluminum channel to put the LED strip in. And this is the aluminum channel and I glued the aluminum channel onto the, onto the timber. And that worked really, really well. And the, this is one of the ends of the uh, five meter strips that both have the same end on, on both ends. And you only need one. So I cut that last little bit off and they fit exactly into here. It is like made for it. So um, yeah, so I did that. And then I also have the, um, the lid for it to, it's a little diffuser. And I started in that corner where the kitchenette is and I cut one of these things in half. So I started with half a length. So I have the um, joints overlapping. So all that worked really well. And it took me about a week to glue this stuff all in and then installing the lights. And uh, I have now four feet in points and um, I will put up a little video clip and a picture how these feet in points work. At the, so I have two things coming in and going either way. So where these 
strips come together where I don't need to put power in, they just join like that. That's, that was the easy part. And what should I tell you? It is exactly 40 meters. <laughs> it is. There was nothing left over at the end. You know, I was really frightened that I got a little gap there at the end, but now it worked out all very well. So, and now as you can see, it's all working well. And I use a Wi-Fi switch to turn them on. Let me show you. Oh, hang on, I need glasses for this, so I can't see things anymore. So um, with that Wi-Fi switch, I can turn all these lights on and off. And what I have also done uh, with the renovation, I removed all light switches. There are no more light switches in this office. Everything is done from the, um, from the, um, from the computer or the phone or the iPad. So that all works really well. I'm really pleased with myself that it all uh, came together the way I had planned. And uh, what's happening now is that um, uh, when they start, they're all at the same sequence. You can program the sequence, by the way, with that. There are little uh, video clips on YouTube how to, how to use these things. So maybe I'll put a link on them. Let's see if I can find it again. And um, so they're all set on the same. It is a, hang on, let me, let me see. It is a slow fade three. And uh, I turned the uh, brightness down as much as I could because these things now serve as my main light here in the office as well. So I throw all the other lights out because this strip is uh, enough. And one of these Wi-Fi switches I have, which I put onto this um, uh, 40 meter light, tells me the power consumption. And um, these eight strips take exactly 220 watts. So I'm very happy with that. That should all work very well. And at night, it looks spectacular. Even during the day, it's not too bad. And uh, with all that, um, I also installed the green screen, the three meters wide and six meters long, and already set the lights up and tried all that out, and it works perfectly. Good, so much for that. Now let me put it all together and then upload this little video clip and then see what happens. Okay, see you later.